Hey everybody, got a hoist here I purchased off of Amazon and I wanted to share it with you. I got the hoist that's up above here, but I probably will be replacing it. So I wanted to get a different one and this one's got a remote to it and my other one does it. And I want to redo the part where I got it hanging at so I can slide it back and forth better. But this here one's got this hair controller and the cable on it's like 25 feet so it gives you plenty of distance if you don't use the remote for it and it also has the controls right here on the handle area that you can use let me turn it on here and when you turn it on airs these lights come on there to show that it's got power to it and the on and off switch is right here on the side and it's just a little rocker switch like. And this cable here is also 25 foot long. And it's rated for 1100 pounds. Which is pretty good, which is more than I will ever need it for because I do a lot of small engine repair stuff. so. I'll be using this mainly to lift the engines on and off because I have back problems so and it'll also help me raise the mowers up and down if I need to get under them to work on them and here on the end of it has a little switch so when you're running the cable back up it'll hit there with that plate and it'll shut it off so you don't over tighten it. Which makes it really nice. The one up here has it too, but it's a different style of setup on it. And the hooks on it I like are a pretty good size hook. Which, like I said, is more than what I will ever need it for, but it's really nice to have. And I could undo this if I needed to and take it out. As long as I got power to it, which I could use an inverter in my truck I have and run it this off of it. If I was to get stuck and needed to pull myself out, if there was something I could hook to, like a tree or something in front of it. The um, manual they set with it is okay, but it don't go into a lot of detail on anything. And this here has brushes in it, and it does not show you how to change those or where it's located at inside the hoist to change it. Which I wish they'd have put that inside the manual. And on the when you do change them, they should have had. A cover about where they're located at so you don't have to take this whole case apart if you had just the cover you could remove and get in there and change them in and out it would have been great but it does not it has a spot on the side here where there's a fan in there for cooling and it's on both sides of this it's like right there and I will show you the brushes here they're just little ones like that it's got the spring on it and a little brass piece on the end so I'm not for sure how they go in there until I'll have to change them someday most likely long as I don't lose them but these brushes should have had more instructions on how to do them and like I said wish it would have had a cover where they go at the remote is just a basic little remote has your up and down button if you order one of these it does not come with the battery it takes a special little battery and I don't remember what it said the size was 
So I will put that in the description probably if I don't forget. The cord here is only about probably 16 inches long or so. It's not real long. So wherever you put it, you will need an extension cord most likely unless you get an outlet right there. On the remote here that's on the cable, it just plugs in. And it has the little twist part there to screw it on so it don't come back out. I got this cord right on my way here. So if I put it up here, I'm definitely going to have to run a cord or put me an outlet right above it. It does have a cap once you take this here manual control off that you can screw on there so it doesn't get dirt and that inside there and ruin it. But overall, it's not a bad little hoist, I don't think. Like I said, it'll do more than what I ever needed to do, long as it lasts is the main thing. And I hope the brushes don't go out on it anytime soon because I really don't want to have to tear it apart and if I do hopefully I can do like I said make me a cover somewhere on it where I can change them in and out easier but overall this is a beam Nova hoist it's a three-in-one portable electric and I will put the information in the link down below in the description so don't forget to check them out on Amazon if you need one of these. They do have other styles that if you're interested, I think they go a lot bigger than what this is. And I'm not sure if they have any that's smaller. But don't forget to like my videos, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button, and have a great day everybody. Bye.